where does inability to connect? Nobody has shifted mm. our position on withdrawal from Somalia. When we talk about the government reaction, the government reaction in, in a, num a numerous numbers of ways. So I think the, the inability for whether to connect some of these things broadly, don't be too narrow. You're too narrow, You're usually in your line of thinking, very simplistic. And I think if it was that easy, uh, I think we, by now uh, you know, it will have been resolved. But I'm saying it was not happening. There has been an escalation. Because if you look at the way Saitoti, the late, managed this type of situation, his template was different. He constantly had these peace meetings. And this must also be backed by confidence building. That it, it has to appear that you know, the, the finance is working, government is, is present. Because these are areas that are extremely underdeveloped. If you look at the, in terms of uh, the battle, the whatever gauge or scale of development, if you just see these areas being played out in the media, you will, tell, you will think it's a different part of Kenya in comparative terms. So therefore, development is the basis for sustainable security. You cannot have sustainable security without development. And therefore, I agree with the, with the with council here with respect to the fact that you need to now also create alternative avenues uh, in terms of, en of enrichment, mm -hmm. in terms of economic mm -hmm. activity. It, it should not just be uh, some mundane cultural practices that, that bear nobody any ben real benefit, but to rather escalate the levels of civil security. We need to, 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 to bring harmony between communities something that I think also the national government doesn't do very well because it just, it's just more of rhetoric rather than you know, real engagement at the grassroots level. And therefore, you need to continue all this multiple-pronged approach. So therefore, that's why I call this is called proactive. Mm. You need to be proactive in terms of maintaining security. It, reactive is what they have just done. You wait for people to get killed. Then you see now you fly there with helicopters, you don your military fatigues, you give warnings, you tell the Pokot elders or whichever other elders to return those guns within 24 hours. If you are a government, why are you asking citizens to return guns? You go the hot pursuit. If you can follow the terrorists to Somalia, you can follow the radar in, 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 in these parts of the country where it be Ringo beats, mm. Pokot beats, anywhere else. So this, this kind of simplistic you know, rhetoric, it, it does, not, does not resolve the issues of insecurity. <laughs> You know, our nose are bloodied, but we are not wounded. We are wounded as a country.